<laughs> Welcome to your first and hopefully last episode of I really wanted to play this game for Throwback Tuesday because it is a Throwback Tuesday game because it was made because it was released in 2014 but at the same time it's still extremely popular and it gets updates all the time and was sold to a massive company that made improvements to it back in like January which was like probably like tw 11 months ago before you saw this video so it's not really going to have a nostalgic vibe but but I'm still going to play it for Throwback Tuesday because it's still technically a throwback game um, and I don't really care if I get hate because you're just going to give me more views check all right we're playing Welcome to Bloxburg. Yes, we are playing Welcome to Bloxburg for Throwback Tuesday. Okay, I just want to... Okay, so... Okay, let's get into this. So, for this to be a proper Throwback Tuesday, I'm just going to try to get... I'm just going to go in my cozy cottage, because that's probably the oldest, like, looking house I've got. Yes, I do play Bloxburg every day, guys. <coughs> This is probably like the oldest looking house I've got in Bloxburg, but look. I mean, come on. Honestly, none of my avatars look like an old, like, Roblox player. Mm. This looks alright, because this has got the freckle face, it's got the, like, OG hair. This is probably the oldest it's going to get, but still... Oh, you know what I hate? When you make, like, a house that you really like, and then you see people with builds that look like Picasso made them. What is this house? This house is beautiful. And they made, like, a city or something. It's like a city? Or a hotel or something? This one's kind of cool. Well, it's closed, but what is this? The house restaurant, bro. People in people in Bloxburg are talented. I'm telling you guys, the house is really nice and aesthetic as well. How do people have such good building skills in Bloxburg, where all I get is a little shoe house looking thing? How? Literally. Okay, maybe I should chill out a little bit, but you you know, right? The the petrol station for me gives back memories. So I'm gonna go to the petrol station. No reason at all. It just gives back. It just gives classic Bloxburg vibes, I guess. In fact, you know what? Actually, no, nah, I don't need to do that. I might. One minute. I'll go on to my um. Wait, I'm. I am not I have an idea, because I really want to work on my, um, I want to work on my flex skill, I want to get to, um, the maximum skill, which is, uh, 30. I want to level up my flex skill, so let's go do it. I'm going to go, um, I'm going to build up my flex skills. Okay, where is the... I could have swore there was something here before. Hmm... <coughs> I don't remember anything. But, mm, I could have swore there was something like blocking this up before. Did they? Did the new developers delete it? Because I could have swore there was something here. Oh, it might be the club. Unless this is the club. If this is the club. Yeah, that's the club. I don't think. Um, I don't think. It, I don't think there was anything there, to be honest. I think I might just be, be being dramatic. But, uh, yeah. I'm gonna go uh, work off my flight skills at the new gym. You know what? The new Bloxburg gym is honestly like so good. I know it's not technically new anymore, but come on, this is like this is like amazing. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go there. Okay, I'm gonna get the protein uh, like nutrition bar thing because that I've, that just makes trick you training a lot quicker the punching bag and the treadmill give the most um athletic skills so i'm gonna go and either one of them hi oh no this is human communication i'm just gonna say hi hi i'm just gonna go on this because this gives that flat level two okay by the way guys i am a premium uh roblox player just in case you um looks for a player not to brag <laughs> well the reason i like to do the treadmill is one someone else might use the boxing obviously two it gives two times of flight skills you get the same from the boxing uh from the boxing bag 
But the reason I don't the the reason I don't use the punching bag is because there's only one and some other people might want to use it, so it's just better to use the treadmills because there's a lot of treadmills. I kind of wish you could turn the TV or the TVs on and just watch TV while you're working out. <laughs> anyway, how quick is my are my skills going up? Oh, it's going up quite quickly. After this, so after this, I get the dumbbell weights rack. But yeah, look, this avatar for me kind of gives back like classic Bloxburg vibes. I mean, I didn't really play Bloxburg until mm, I'd have to say extremely late 2018. I think I started playing it like December 2018. I think something around that. But yeah, I'm just look. I just keep running. My character just won't stop running. <laughs> Alright, anyway, my uh, my nutrition bar ran out, so now I'm literally just running. How my skills? She just ran out of a water bottle. But look, this is giving back. This avatar is giving classic Bloxburg vibes because, first of all, the hair, like that hair, I have not seen people use that hair. Like, I have not seen people use that hair apart excluding myself for at least maybe like six months to be honest i don't see anyone using the bell hair anymore this freckle face barely anybody uses anymore and that's a classic roblox face i used to use it all the time the outfit mm, it's it's given like I, well, I mean, nobody wears stuff like this on Roblox. The shoes definitely are not a uh, classic Bloxburg, but maybe like the pants are. They look kind of classic, and the the, the 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 shirt isn't. I literally I've literally seen no one else use the shirt though. MGM so quirky. <laughs> no one's like me. <laughs> but yeah, uh, yeah, you get my point. Um, I want to get my flutter cup to seventeen in this video. Will I be able to do it? Possibly. Also, I love the new bat part. This is actually a really good um, addition. I think the new developers have actually done quite well with Bloxburg. I think they've done it quite well. I just wish they wouldn't have changed it so drastically. Like, it doesn't really feel like... Sometimes when I play, it doesn't feel like I'm playing Bloxburg. Which is weird, but... um, But, you know, like, it's not necessarily a bad thing. It's... It is a bit of an improvement to when um, the original developers were doing it. And Bloxburg has always been a good game. It's always been, like, in my top five favourite games. Yes, that might surprise you, but Bloxburg is actually in my top five games. I think if I had to rank my favourite games, I'd probably give Bloxburg as, like, a four. Like, my top four favourite. My fourth favourite, but, yeah, you know. Yeah, you know, guys, you know. Okay, I'm just gonna get a nutrition bar just to speed this up a little bit because this is actually taking a really long time. I know that training takes forever in Bloxburg, but I'm just impatient, guys. There's no one else in the gym, so you know what? I'm just gonna use the punching bag. Why not? Look, I'm a boxer. Look at me, guys. I'm a boxer. Look at this person. I'm a professional boxer. But yeah, like, Bloxburg is still a really good game, but, you know. I think something that needs to be changed after maybe the Halloween update, what I like, what I think, because they improved the gym drastically, they improved the burger place, what I think, personally, needs just a little bit of improvement, is maybe, like, um, the furniture shop. I mean... The furniture shop isn't bad at all, don't get me wrong, I love the furniture shop. But it's just very bland and kind of like boring-ish. I wish, I think they should at least add a bit more furniture, maybe even a second floor, that would be really cool. Bit more furniture, maybe put the price, maybe add some furniture in there that you can't buy in build mode, that would be really cool. Maybe add some like, kind of like cheapish furniture. Some nice designed furniture. I know from we can't see me. They make some really nice stuff. You know, I think that would just be a really good idea because I know a lot of people want a brace the pizza place. I personally don't. I think the pizza place is already kind of perfect. Maybe some light touches to it, but other than that, I think it's a pretty good like place. 
And I also love the that the Bloxburg City Hall, because we wanted it to be a school, but they made it into a library, which in my opinion is an improvement. That's uh, that's an improvement, but... Anyway, what's going on here? So, what's my skill up so far? Oh, it's just going to take way too long to get 17. Right, so... Right, so I'm gonna, um, I'm actually gonna end the video here, guys. I do genuinely hope that you enjoyed this video. I personally have actually had a really good time making this video. I like, you know, I like playing Bloxburg and stuff. Well, um, well, yeah, guys, I, I do genuinely hope that you enjoyed watching this video. Uh, I hope that, I hope that this, this throwback Tuesday didn't disappoint you. I know this video was a little bit short, but this is like what I'm aiming. 10, 15 minutes, like max. 10 minutes, like minimum for throwback Tuesdays. But anyway, guys, I will see you in the next video. Throwback Tuesday, short or community post, whatever you want. I don't care. Maybe I'll just pop up. Uh, pop up. Okay, bye, Alyssa.